Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you a crash test. I will be comparing the status of these two cars as they crash into this crane, which is a pretty big one. So let's get started. So now I'll be also using Sonic, Shadow and Silver in each of these cars. So when I place them in the seats, I will see how well they are when the car is crashed. So I'll be placing Sonic, Shadow and Silver in this car for the first test. So this is how I'm going to test each car. First I'm going to start each of these cars in this line. And in each car will travel at about the same velocity across this length and hit the crane on the side ground. Whichever car is, remains in the best condition will win. And it also means that that car will be better built. So now I'm going to start the test. In 3, 2, 1. And yes, that was the crash. Pretty fast. But let's check it out. Um, I think I'm going to take the top though crane part of it for a while and yeah it looks pretty safe in there and we see shadows head buttons up the sonic's back and silver's nearly fall out of the car but the sonic seems to smash his face blue and shield nothing else damaged the car the crane seems perfectly fine not surprisingly so yes that is the first test let's try the second round and now for round two and three Two, one. Ah, that should work. Anyway, let's check out the conditions. So, yep, the crane winch is falling off. Looks like this builder guy is seen fine. And now, we'll check out the more important car. Looks pretty bad. Sun's falling out flat in space. Silver's pushing himself right into the front. And Shadow is already over there. I guess in a hurry to get out of here. And over on the car, everything does seem fine. Except for the windshield is kind of broken off. And yeah, the parts are scattered quite all around. So yes, this car has kept up pretty well. Yes, the passengers aren't very safe in this car. So yes, now to present the rating of this car. So I think this car held up pretty well, although the passengers weren't very safe. So in that case, I think I'm going to give it a 7 on 10. So now in the red car we have Sonic and Shadow driving. Unfortunately there is no back seat in this car so sorry Servo, I guess you're gonna be left out for this test. Which might be good for them because I don't think he wants to get any more injuries. So yeah. This car um it's a bit bigger than that other car and I mentioned in one of my reviews. If you want you can check out that one of my recent videos. So let's now test this car. So now I'm going to be testing this car in 3, 2, 1. Ow, that should have really good for the train operator. So let's check it out. Surprisingly for that speed, the car held up very well. Just a sign of the roof panel being broken off. So I can shadow still in the car intact. Um, Steve Sonic has smashed himself into the floor and shadow I have no idea what's wrong with him. You see, he also smashed his head to the floor. Um, the hood came off the bit and so the winch was a little bit damaged. Nothing really major. But what's really major is the crane. It's the winch kind of broke off and the box is lying all the way over here. And see the this car took the whole boom down. Wow. I guess a lot of cross the state to get in all. And now I'm gonna chop the second round of this crash in in three. Two, one. Ow. That wasn't very really major damage. So let's check it out. That was the same speed we were so don't think that I lost this slow. Oh yes, everything held up almost perfectly. Get out of my way. Hmm. Yeah, everything held up really perfectly. Only the crane actually got wrecked in the office cab. This is a very dangerous job in my videos. And the car is actually perfect. Only Sonic and Shadow kind of smashed into themselves. And it's just some airbags. And yeah, actually yeah, everything held up pretty well. No major damage. Only that roof is somewhere over here. And that was not very good for the screen guy. Got a lot of damage around. 
So now to give this car's rating. So yes, this car had looked pretty well and um, Sonic and Shadow hadn't fallen out of the car and if this was a real car and had airbags, I'm pretty sure they would have been fine. So I'm going to give this car a rating of 9 on 10, which makes this car the winner in the crash test. So that's it guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe if you already haven't. And thank you for watching.